Hey, what's up everybody? Welcome back to the channel. Golden God here. Today I got a special video for you. We're doing an unboxing of Cresco's Durban Sativa Liquid Live Resin Cartridge. We got the pen here all fully charged up. Make sure to go ahead and subscribe to the channel and click that like button. I'm really excited to try this strain out. We did try a Grapefruit Durban by Terrapin that we recorded a video for. It's not up on the channel yet, but it will be probably within a week, so go and try that out. Uh, we also, well, I also, uh, we just did a video on Cresco's Mint Face Off OG, and we bought uh, two strains that we could also uh, buy. We lucked out and were able to find uh, the flower versions of that. So we got Mint Face Off OG in the flower, and also its Liquid Live Resin cartridge, which we already did a video for for the for that but not the flower yet. We'll do that in a separate video. Today's video is on uh, the Cresco Durban uh, Live Resin 1 gram cartridge, which is 90 to $100 in Pennsylvania, and this we'll do in a separate video, Cresco's Durban Sativa Dry Flower. If you're new to my channel, if you are new to my channel, please subscribe. Uh, please click that thumbs up like button, click the notification bell one time, and leave a comment down below. I'm going to read off this, uh, the potency analysis and the terpene percentages, and you can go ahead and do that. All right. THC, 68.983%. THCA, 0%. I know these, this, this, this uh, strain is uh, like... Not, I don't know if it's legendary, but very popular and has a very high uh, terpene uh, percentage. A CB, uh, THCA 0%, CBD 0.123%, CBDA 0%. Okay, uh, potency analysis, CBC 0.87%, CBD 0.123%, CBG 2.357%, CBN 0.111%, THC 68.983%, THCV 3.812% terpene analysis. A terpene 0.46%, B carefelene 0.477%, B myrcene 1.276%, B pinene 0.305%, B sabolo 0.075%, camphene 0.005%, carine 0.248%, humulene 0.13%, limonene 0.38%. Um, 389%, linalool 0.017%, osamine 2.946%, pinene 0.199%, terpaline 862%. Total terpenes 15.43%. Terpene, Y terpene 0.168%, and this was packaged on uh, March 29th, 2022. And this was purchased at Keystone Canna Remedies Dispensary in Allentown, PA. It's my first time going there. Uh, go there your first time. Check them out. Uh, you get a 40% discount your first time. So, And they have a, a nice selection, and uh, it's a cool place. Check out, uh, I don't know if I uploaded the video, uh, video yet, but I recorded the actual inside of the dispensary until they told me to stop. So uh, that video will definitely be going up on the channel. But let's go ahead and uh, get this open here. Now we got I Heart Jane up on here. This is a Vapes uh, Sativa, the Strain Durban. Description, live resin cartridge hailing from South Africa. Look at that color. Well, they always do have a lot of headspace on the top there, but still really, really nice. Look at that beautiful, beautiful color. It's gonna taste amazing. Okay. We got four minutes in here. Hailing from South Africa, this strain is beloved for its high levels of resin production and bright, robust flavors. Although commonly reg regarded as being one of the most energetic sativas, uh, parents, uh, I'm sorry, patients report Durban to deliver potent physical relief after its initial rush has subsided. Durban is a must try for any sativa fan. Cheers, everybody. You gotta get your hands on this, seriously. This tastes amazing. All Cresco carts do, and Prime Wellness carts, and Moxie carts, and so many others. Okay, uh, top terpenes, like we said before, terpaline, osamine, flavors you're gonna taste, 
uh, earthy, pine, reported effects, energetic, and you're going to feel happy. I don't know if I already said it, it's getting a 4.3 stars out of a possible 5 out of uh, 629 current reviews. Our liquid live resin is sourced from a single cannabis strain. Nothing added, nothing taken away, n never separated, never reconstituted. We captured the full original spectrums uh, uh, effects of fresh flower and the convenience of a cartridge. The flower right here, same flower. Rise products are derived from sativa strains known for energizing and uplifting effects. Rise strains pair well with everyday activities like housekeeping, happy hour, and physical activities. And then I'll uh, leave this in the uh, description below so you can read all the reviews here. We'll move on to leaffly.com. Okay, now this is only getting, <coughs> this is the 500 milligram cartridge. It's getting a 4.5 stars out of only two reviews, which I'm kind of surprised about. Since I know this, this is, has been around for a little bit. Our liquid live resin is sourced from a single cannabis strain. Nothing added, nothing taken away. Same information. Rise products are drained from, uh, derived from sativa strains known for energizing and uplifting effects. Rise strains pair well with everyday activities like housekeeping. Same thing. Uh, prevalent terpenes, terpene, osamine lineage. It just says African. We'll find out more about that. Flavor, earthy pine, uh, feel, uh, reported effects, energetic, energetic, happy, hailing from South Africa. Same, same, uh, Leaf Eye has the same, uh, like about this product in description as iHeart Jane does. Uh, we'll move on to weedmaps.com here. They also have a half gram. Oh wait, this is Durban Haze I'm just seeing now for the first time. So we're gonna skip that actually. But we will uh, go on to crescocannabis.com slash strain slash Durban. We'll leave in the description below. And it literally has almost the same information here. Hailing from uh, South Africa, this sativa strain is beloved for its high levels of resin production and bright, robust flavors. Although commonly regarded as being one of the most energetic sativa some patients report durban delivers potent physical relief after its initial rush has subsided durban is a must try for any sativa fan and then they got a beautiful picture here on cannabis of like all their strains like really up close i like that they do that uh matri uh they do that on their their site too this it says here too this strain is currently available in illinois massachusetts and pennsylvania hopefully it's available in some uh more states it says the average THC for the uh, dry flower is 24 to 26%. This is saying THCA 23.303, THC 0 0.503, CBD 0%, and then CBD, CBDA 0. either 0.70% or 970%. Or it's kind of faded off a little bit. But, <clears throat> and then just to end it here, it has uh, the flavor earthy and pine and lineage it just has one strain and it just says african so maybe if somebody could leave in the comments if they have any more uh information on where durban comes from like is it is it uh if it's only one strain does that mean it's a, a land race i i don't know so if somebody could comment maybe more about that that knows knows more information than i do a reported effects, same thing, energetic and happy, which I'm definitely am feeling. I'm definitely going to give this a 9 out of 10. Got this from Keystone Canna Remedies, like we said earlier, and it was either, I think I think it was definitely 90 to 100. 90 to 100. That's going to be our last hit for the day. That beautiful, beautiful amber amber color and that pine earthy taste and aroma it just smells and tastes amazing like I smoked earlier before because I had to make a, a different video and I'm definitely feeling good from the indica and from the sativa 
the the mint face off, and now from Cresco, we have finally tried their Durban one gram carts, and I, I highly highly recommend if you're really into sativas or if you want to try something new and you want to start try uh, try sativa, definitely pick up Durban, and if you can pick it up by Cresco, and um, please subscribe and click that notification bell because in the next videos. We'll be doing unboxing videos, separate videos for each one, for Durban here on the left and on the right here, Mint Face, is it Mint Face or is it Mint Face Off? Mint Face Off. Mint Face Off. Just like uh, we did for the uh, Mint Face Off live resin cartridge in a separate video before. So I hope you all subscribe and definitely cl click that like video. Got an alarm going off in the background. Hopefully that's not too loud. but. I hope everybody enjoyed today's video. And let me just get a quick shot here for a thumbnail. Get the hunter gotta get the Tegrity Farm shirt in the background. Alright, I'll see everybody in the next video. Everyone stay safe. Peace.